long time no see. I know it's been like a month or something. I know I've been a little MIA for my channel. Reason being, if you read my Facebook page post, you would know, but if you don't, here it goes. I had an eye infection, which was not pretty at all. Had crusty eyes, it was just not pretty, and I still have a little bit of like dryness around my eyes, but we still deal with that. Uh, but yeah, here's a haul for you guys, because I wanted to start off my uh, year, I guess, all late, but with the haul, because you know what? I know you guys like my hauls, and well, here's just some of the stuff I've been accumulating over the past month, month and a half, you know, Christmas sales and all that jaws. So, here we go. Alright, so first things first, I'm gonna start off with Buff and Body Works because, um, you know, the sale, the ducky sale as I like to call it, the semi-annual sale was going on and I went a little crazy. I didn't get any lotions because I'm not into the lotions anymore because I have a lot of lotions that I haven't used. And um, I did some deep cleaning the other day in my closet and I got rid of some, like a lot of lotions that I hadn't used. So I was like, that's a waste of money. I'm not gonna buy lotions because I didn't use them that much. Um, I usually just use perfumes and like um, any lotion, other lotion I have around the house. But yeah, anyways, I went there for the shower gels and uh, soaps. So that's pretty much all I got. I got a pretty big amount of shower gels. I got a whole bunch of different uh, scents. So I got this whole range of this um, like sparkly, um, I don't know, like it has a sparkly tag to it. Um, from there, they're from um, all over the world, like Paris, New York, what is this? Um, and Hawaii, I don't think I got the other one. Um, I think there was four, maybe more, I don't know. But I got Hawaii, I got Paris, and I got New York. So they all smell pretty good. New York says Big Apple Caramel Mommy. What a biggie, like Big Apple, New York, you know, you get that. Paris is pink champagne and tulips, so this is like that. And then Hawaii is coconut water and pineapple. If you know me, if you've been with my channel, I love coconut smells. I don't like coconut, but I like coconut smells, so got these. That's the first bag. And then another one I got on that same trip, I got this other one that I freaking love. Um, I'm using it currently right now in my shower, the other one I had. Uh, but it is Maui Mango Surf. Um, I'm currently trying to look for this typeface right here. I mean like graphic designer, me and designer. I'm trying to look for this typeface on the bottom that says Mango Surf. I'll do a close up of all these like, uh, what you call it, shower gels so you guys can see a better look at them. But Mango Surf, like what is that Thai face? I'm trying to look for that. If you guys know, let me know down below. Cause I'm freaking, I wanna know what that Thai face is. So some of the shower gels I got was Midnight Pomegranate, um, Sweet Summer Kiss, Cool Coconut Surf, and Sunset by the Pool. All of these smell like tropically, kinda smells, um, mostly all of them, so. You know me. And then the last few things I got were some soaps. They were all $3 soaps. So I had to get on that. I like the ones that kind of, you know, foam up. So I got the ones that foam. I got T Tahitian Paradise. Um, it smells so good. I got Magnolias and Mimosas. This one, her. And then I got Island Pink Pomelo. Pomelo. I don't know. So it's like this. Um, I just love the smell. And then I got this little pump thing. Um, I don't know where I'm going to use this for, but I, it was sparkly and um, bedazzled. So I had to get it. It was like $1.50 or something like that. $1.25 or so, somewhere around there. It was pretty inexpensive. So I got it. I don't know what I'm going to use it in. Um, I don't know if you can use it on the shower gels. Let me see. You might, yeah, maybe I can use it on my shower gels to have like a little pump. So I got that, so that's pretty much all I got from Bath & Body Works. Alright guys, changing of setting, I had to close my blinds, I was super bright, I looked at myself and I was like, damn. I'm white. Anyways, I still look white, but anyways. I made a little trip to Hobby Lobby and I got this like geometric heart shape. So it's in gold, um, metal and stuff, so I'm gonna hang it, um, over there where all my stuff is at. Um, I did have a DIY for that tassel string thing you can barely see. Um, if you guys want me to post it, I will post it. I do have it. I just haven't got around to editing it. Editing it. So I need the little voiceover and stuff like that. But if you guys want me to post that, I will post it. Um, so yeah. Got this and it was um, $9.99 but I used my little 40% off so it was like 6 bucks or something like that. Something like that. It was really um, inexpensive to me at least so for a little cute decorating piece. Went to Target and I got a bunch of stationery stuff and what you call it, uh, Valentine's Day stuff because I want to decorate my room for 
Valentine's Day and all that jazz. Not because I love Valentine's Day, it's because it's my birthday. So yeah, it's creeping around, keep creeping up around the corner. So yeah. Anyways, I got some things from the dollar and three dollar section. So all this Target got me. Target got me. So. I got these pencils because these were uber uber cute and I couldn't leave it behind as a little decorating piece or use one set and not use the other one. It is wood pencils with the like the bottom tip of it, the bottom half of it, well not half of it but you know what I mean. The bottom part is in mint. That is freaking amazing. I got these set of six, each set of six for a dollar and mint wood, I mean can't get better than that, right? So the next thing I got was a like um, nope, like a stationary sticky note set. Um, it has a calendar on the top. I'll do close-ups and all that jazz. It has a calendar on the top, and it's in a mint color. It has polka dots all over, like confetti all over it, and it just has like a little notepad on the bottom, a list pad. So I got this, and it was a dollar, and it's just super cute. It has pink, gray, and mint. I just love that combo right now. Some other things I got was for my. Okay, so I got myself a planner, guys. Yeah. Yes, I'm going to do more planning in my planner and be more organized, which reminds me, I'm going to show you guys my planner. So I got this planner from, I don't remember the store name, but I saw it on Hey Claire's Snapchat and I immediately went to go look up that username or something. She posted something that set the name or the website or something like that. So I went straight to that and I bought myself a planner. Looks like this. It has marble, marble, bleh, marble print on it, and it's just freaking cute and so amazing. It has gold detail to it. It has like gold edging and a gold spiral, and in the inside, it just looks freaking amazing. It has like a bunch of details, like uh, if you drink your water, but you can always switch that up to something else, like a checklist and stuff like that. So. Um, I did do my planning, but I haven't like decorated it or anything. It's January, so if you guys want me to do planning videos, um, like decorating your planner and whatnot, because I have a lot of stationary stickers and I'm like, I should probably get all that planning gig. So if you guys want to do February's plan with me video, leave me a comment down below and I will be sure to get on that because I have a lot of stickers that I want to put in my planner for February. So the next few things I got were these die cut gift tags. So in my like in my mind, I was gonna use these to do to put in my planner, like cut a few holes on it, and then just stick it in my planner as a little like I don't know, little decoration thingy. So I got these for that purpose because I don't usually give gifts on Valentine's Day. I'm sorry, but I don't. Um, so yeah, <laughs> yeah. Anyways, um, I got this birthday card because it was just too cute to leave behind. It has gold foiling on the balloons. It has like a bunch of detail to it. I just love how it was, how it looked, and it was just super cute. And you can never have enough like birthday cards on hand, especially the cute ones. So, have a birthday card for any friend that has a birthday coming up. So, if you have a birthday coming up, this may be for you. So, the next things I got were arrow ornaments, and the cool thing about this is you can write on them with chalk. So you can hang these. Um, I don't know where I'm gonna hang these, but probably back there in my backdrop, like you know, somewhere you could probably see it. Uh, so yeah, I have these arrows, and I'm just really into arrows, and it was just so much better that it was in chalkboard. So I don't, I don't think I'm gonna write in them, but just so cute. They were a dollar. Um, the next things I got here comes the arrow trend. I got this one. It says foil banner, and it's just a bunch of arrows, like. How cool is this? Like it comes in a red string and yeah, it's like a ban well, it is a banner with a bunch of arrows to it. It has hearts on it, has red foil going on around it, and I just thought for a dollar can't it was super cute to decorate my room with. Next things I got were um, some stickers. I got these, um, it's just one sheet of stickers, which is pretty bummer, but they're like um 3D kind of stickers. Um so yeah, I got these, they're just a bunch of hearts and they're kind of foamy kind of stickers, so yeah, put a little 3D touch to my planner. And the next few stickers I got, next set of stickers, the only set of stickers I have left, is wood stickers, which I thought that was freaking cool. It's just um, some hearts and some arrows, and they're made out of wood. Hello, that's different. So, a dollar, wood stickers, um, got him. Got he. <laughs> uh, so, the next things I got were some um, note cards. Um, I don't know, maybe, because I'm selling some stuff on... Um, Vinted and other like like stuff. I'm I'm per like I'm cleaning out my closet. Seriously, I need to like downsize my closet big time because I'm just like 
I'm getting to that age where I'm like, I don't need to be wearing this stuff. Well, I could if I wanted to, but I'm like, it's not my style anymore. So I'm getting rid of, rid of a whole bunch of stuff, like donating, selling, throwing away the trash. So yeah, anyways, I got these note cards for like, if when I sell something, put a little note in there. It has arrows to it. Again, I'm obsessed with arrows, so yeah. The next things I got were from Ross. I know you guys love my Ross hauls, but I just didn't have enough things to put in a Ross haul. Don't worry, March is coming around and I get my 40% off again. So double discount, yeah baby. So I got these frames, um, they were on sale and they just look freaking pretty. Like seriously, they are in gold foil and one is one doesn't have foil to it. Um, it says, hello beautiful. Alright, so the other one says, it seems impossible until it's done. I just love the frame to it and they were $249 and $349. So with my discount, couldn't leave that behind and I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna probably switch them out for those two down there. And the next thing I got was this Marquee um, ampersand sign, and it's in a metal, and I just need batteries to go with it. So yeah, it lights up. It's battery, you know, it needs batteries, so I need to get some AA batteries for this. And that's pretty much all I got from Ross. I know, right? I like controlled myself. <laughs> Seriously, I don't think I bought any clothes. Maybe I did. Alright guys, so I lied. I did buy clothes and I just dug them out of my closet and here it is. I bought this simple like gray top. It kind of looks like the top I'm wearing but it has no lettering on it. So, and it's just, I don't know, I like these kind of tops right now. They're like, I don't know, 90s feel to me and it's really soft and stretchy and it fits really nice so I got it. Um, the next few pieces I got was this one. It's kind of like a pajama top for me, kind of. Um, but it says life begins after coffee, so I've been I've, I've seriously become a coffee drinker in the past like few months now, and I'm just like addicted to coffee. Well, not addicted to coffee. I like I can live without coffee, but I've been having a coffee every now and then. So got this, and it was four forty nine, and I did believe the other top was like eight ninety nine. I know kind of expensive, but yeah. Anyways, I got this other one. It's a maroon top. It says New York Soho, and this one was three ninety nine, and it's just in a magenta, not magenta, a maroon wine color, and I'm just really digging this color. Yeah, loving, loving, loving this color. All right, guys. So the last few things I'm gonna show you guys are all stationary wise, stationary wise, stationary related um they are like christmas related stationary things so um but you know what i'm gonna show you guys because they were really cheap so the most expensive okay they're from okay i got a few things from hobby lobby and a few things from michael's michael's were the words like the where like it was it was really good sales going on so i got this um mambi sheets uh like scrapbook paper um sheets it has a whole bunch of designs that i can use for my designs and to overlay it on top so that's what I'm gonna do with these um, hopefully and maybe sell some on my Etsy I don't know maybe maybe um, but yeah got this really big like it has 48 sheets with the really pretty designs and I got this for um, I believe it was like three dollars or something like that. well maybe three or four dollars I don't remember but it was really cheap and the sales were banging left eyes so I got that and then the next thing I got was this other big set of like uh, scrapbook paper. Um, it's, it's called Recollections um, Sugar Plum Pad pa Paper Pad, and it comes with 180 sheets. With it's friggin' amazing! Like seriously, I'm like I died when I saw this, and I saw how much it was. I think this was like five dollars. I think this was the most expensive thing I got. Um, but it was a really good deal. These were originally, I believe, I don't remember how much it was, like $10 maybe, something like that, maybe more. I don't remember, but it was a really good deal to not take advantage of. So, next scrapbook related thing was this one. It's freaking a glitter paper. I don't know if you can see that. Wait, hold on. Wrong way. It's glitter paper. Like, hello? Like, glitter pretty much flies everywhere. That's a mistake I made with this paper. But maybe I could just, like, spray some stuff on it to make it, like, not move. Um, it's called Marky Love. Um, it's by Heidi Swap. I think this thing's supposed to go in your, like, marquee thing. Like, I have a marquee, like, a G over there. I think it's supposed to go inside there. Like, you decorate it. But, nonetheless, I'm going to use this for other things because I did decorate that thing already I put marble contact paper inside of it so it looks freaking cool uh, so I got this one and I believe this was like a dollar or something so me glitter couldn't leave it behind 
All right, so the last few things I got from um, Michaels, I got this thing for like my scrap, my my scrapbook. Like I have a scrapbook. Well, I do have a scrapbook, but that's like really old. Um, I got this uh, thing from Recollections Winter Frost. Um, they're like these little, I don't know, sticky thingy decoration thingies that I could probably use in my planner for next year. Uh, for like because it's coming December like December is like right around the corner like yeah anyways next December like this you know what I mean next December I can use this in my planner so just to jazz things up a bit in my planner and I believe that's all I got oh here's the receipt to um, Michaels oh the the scrapbook paper I was totally wrong there were $3.99 each on the big like pad paper and then the marquee glitter one was $1.79 and the snowflake that I just showed you guys was 79 cents so, on to Hobby Lobby, I believe, I guess I got some more things at Hobby Lobby. So, this was another trip I made, like, seriously, I've been, like, hoarding this stuff in the corner of my closet, guys, waiting to do a video that I couldn't do. So, yeah, anyways, got some things from Hobby Lobby. The things I got were these bows right here. I got them because they were on sale for, they're originally $3.99, they're on sale for 50% off. So I got these for $1.99, so I got these bows right here, and I think I'm going to make them into little clips, so little paper clip doodad thingies, so I got these bows right here, and that's pretty much going to wrap up my haul, oh, I got the, um, oh, oh, one last thing, I got the Ariana Grande, um, lipstick, the MAC lipstick, and I'm wearing it right now, so you can see how it looks on me and my skin tone, it is very dark, and it's very vampy, and, um, it's not drying at all, like, I've had this for a couple of, um, uh, hours on, so it's not drying at all, and I, I love it, so, if you're into the vampy colors, get yourself the Ariana Grande lipstick. So that pretty much wraps up my haul video. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And don't forget to give, leave me a thumbs up because that helps out my channel. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button to see if, when I put up more videos and stuff like that. So yeah, just leave me a comment down below uh, with any requests you have for videos because I want to crunch out like videos. Like seriously, like I was in a little rut the other day and I was like, I don't know what to film. I'll probably just refilm some of my old videos, but I just want to know what you guys want to see on my channel. Like I know you guys want to see hauls and that's for sure coming up, but we're not getting, you know, some moolah and um yeah but other than that what other kind of videos would you guys want to see so leave a comment down below with that and or just you know just leave me some other comment i'll reply to you um i love talking to you guys so don't forget to follow me on instagram snapchat um i am on twitter a little bit i'm not that active and i'm not that active on my facebook which i'm trying to change that but yeah that's pretty much my social media stuff and my blog so i updated my blog like seriously i really like vamp my blog if you guys didn't know and you should probably check it out so yeah um that's pretty much it um hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys